Hey guys, in this video, we'll lay out our expectations of the Tesla Model Q, the name that the internet has given it. Tesla's affordable electric car that's coming out in the first half of this year. Now, this is not clickbait. This is not fake news. Watch the video to find out more. Tesla plans to launch its most affordable vehicle yet by June 2025. And unlike the Cybercab, which is set for 2026, this car will be manually drivable, meaning that it'll have pedals and a steering wheel. During the Q4 2024 earnings call last month, Tesla's CFO confirmed that the company remains on track to introduce the new entry-level EV in the first half of 2025. Before we talk about the car, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to stay up to date with future EVs. While official body style and technical details are yet to be revealed, the Tesla Model Q, which is an unofficial name, is expected to draw inspiration from the new Model Y and the Model 3. As seen in our illustrations, we expect a compact aerodynamic design with sufficient cabin space for four adults and three large suitcases. Tesla has confirmed that it will manufacture the vehicle in an existing facility, which would then either be Fremont, California or Austin, Texas. Tesla's latest financial report indicates that the car will incorporate aspects of both the current and next generation platforms. This suggests a hybrid approach, where components developed for the new Model Y will be integrated into a new cost-effective platform. Tesla's Master Plan 3 document published in April 2023 suggests that Tesla's future compact EV will use lithium iron phosphate batteries with an estimated 53 kilowatt hour capacity. While LFP batteries have lower energy density, they are cheaper, last longer, and perform better in varying temperatures. Considering the vehicle's size, this battery could deliver an EPA-estimated range of around 250 miles. As for the features, the Model Q is expected to feature bi-directional charging capabilities, including vehicle-to-load and vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle functions. This will let customers charge their electronic appliances, power tools, or even other electric vehicles. Additionally, Tesla will likely replace the traditional 12-volt auxiliary battery with a more efficient 48-volt system. This should reduce wiring complexity and weight, and improve energy efficiency. Tesla is also expected to offer full self-driving as an optional upgrade in the Model Q. The company's supervised hands-free driving feature, available in current models, automates steering, acceleration, and braking on supported roads. Talking about the pricing, Tesla is likely to position the Model Q starting at around $35,000. If the $7,500 federal EV tax credit continues under the Trump administration, the effective price could fall below $30,000, making it the most affordable Tesla ever launched. As for the competition, the Model Q will compete with the top-end variants of the next-gen Chevy Bolt, which arrives in late 2025. Jeep has confirmed that the next-gen Renegade Electric will start below $25,000, while Ford is developing a new platform for affordable EVs, expected to spawn a compact vehicle after 2027. The higher variants of these models would also be viewed as its competitors. What features are you most looking forward to in the Model Q? Drop your comments below, and we'll see you in the next video.